You're a runner. Excellent. That idiot that would sat on my glasses in the canteen and I'm blind as a bat. <laughs> How can I help Alfie if I can't see anything? I've got a backup pair at my place. It's not far away. It's, you know, I can't get there myself. You need anything else while I'm there? Oh my god, you'll do this for me? Thank you. Oh, and um, one more thing. See, we're going to start a vegetable garden on the roof, you know, so we can maybe not starve to death. But nobody here really knows how to do it. On my birthday, I, I got a book on gardening. I never read it. It's growing vegetables for dum-dums or something like that. It should be on a bookcase, but, you know, you might have to look around for it. Bookcase, he said. Okay. Do it yourself, a horse head map. Big butt bonanza. Nice. See, defeat a couch potatoes guide to vegetable guy. That's the one. Wet dream, the first romance novel for plumbers. Good God. The falafel diet. DVD player user manual. Simple tricks to get the chick. Big book of death metal. Pain. <laughs> How to look good over 40. Thousand one banana recipes.
People are counting on you to help them. Hey, you've got my glasses and the book? Ah, that's great. Good lord, my glasses are filthy. What have you been doing with them? No, 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 never mind. It, it doesn't matter. Here, let me give you something for your trouble. It is Crane, yes? Let me give you some friendly advice. Uh, sure, even though I, I don't think we've met. My name is Ibrahim, but that is not important. What is important is that you may find yourself dealing with a man called Tahir. Yeah, Rice is second in command. What about him? I was unfortunate enough to share a cell with Tahir for a number of years. The kind of prisons we have here much of the time, once you are locked up, you do not ever walk back out into the sunlight. But Tahir survived behind bars. More than that, he thrived. And he did so by unleashing a kind of brutality one sees among wild animals. Once, a group of five men fashioned knives out of toothbrush handles and surrounded Tahir. They meant to overwhelm him and cut his throat. Tahir took two of their knives away. With a blade in each hand, he was like a bear, slashing, gouging, and ripping. He damaged their bodies so badly, they had to be identified by dental records. Jesus. Rice is brilliant, I'm getting more calls cool, from other parts of the city. and twisted. But exercise just as much caution around Tahir as you would around his leader. He is a beast in the shape of a man. <laughs> 